Welcome to Vlog 38. So I got a surprise for you guys, the individuals that tune in regularly to the vlogs. I was tagged into a post on Facebook uh, of a friend who's an educator right now. And it's pretty unique because he has a Motivational Mondays, which he gets, you know, he comprises a list of videos from, you know, real individuals. And he asks uh, them questions like, who are they, what obstacles they've overcome, and where they're at right now. And then he presents those videos off to his students, which I think is amazing. Um, if I would have uh, received that when I was younger, I think it will, uh, would, you know, help so much in the progression of myself uh, as I am right now. So I want to be able to partake in that. So here we go. <laughs> Who am I? I am Danny Martin. Um, I'm 27 years old and I'm a Dallas native. I've grown up in you know, an urban community. I went to college for athletics. I, I studied entrepreneurship. I've um, experienced startup life in San Francisco. I've worked with big corporations. Uh, I, you know, I've experienced a lot. I've traveled, um, but not only that, I did that without you thinking that I had this silver spoon in my hand. I did that with just by utilizing the resources that were available to me. You know, that the one, number one resource is the ability to want to learn. You know, I didn't recognize that when I was young in school. I was a class clown. I would get in fights. I would get suspended. I would talk back. I would do a lot of things that you'd be like, come on, why are you here right now? What did you just change in your life? And one of the biggest things is that I calm myself down and I ask more questions uh, versus thinking I know it all. And that's one of the biggest things that you're going to be able to gain inside of your mind if you want to be a successful individual. You always have to be willing to learn and listen. You know, that's one of the keys that I, I feel like if anyone had to ask me, like, why are you successful or why are you at where you're at today? And it's the ability to want to learn, you know, always want to learn. And, you know, so when you got an individual like, Mr. White, who's asking, you know, presenting videos to you guys of individuals like me and whomever else, you know, that's in itself is amazing because if you take this information, I can guarantee you you'll find yourself so much more successful uh, than if you hadn't take this information. You know, so one of the biggest obstacles that I come across on a daily basis with uh, my endeavors, which is um, a application that allows these gamers over 18 to compete for monetary compensation. You know, one of the biggest things is being able to uh, persuade the older demographic that the fact that, you know, you're just not gaming for our fun. There's a way that you can be able to uh, either get scholarships or be a professional gamer, which you get paid for. And that's the one of the biggest obstacles to climb because those individuals that are, are much older are the ones that are uh, helping with funding or getting you out there as far as exposure. So convincing them is one of the biggest things of having a successful business. And this is something I, I have an obstacle uh, going on every single day. Also, the parents, just as much as I was that individual who uh, uh, spent a lot of time with my brother and he would play games. And I'm just like, man, you ain't doing anything, you know. And I know that there's many other families. I'm sure your mom or dad or if you were a gamer, probably the exact same way. You know, for, so for me, I wanted to say, hey, what can I do? What can, how can I take my skills of what I've learned in college uh, and, and through life? And how can I be able to create something that can change the dynamics uh, of what I've experienced or what I've had to go through? And this is where you see me at right now, you know? And I'm pretty excited because it's something I'm really passionate about. I do it all the time. As I state, I am an entrepreneur, so I make my own schedule. But naturally, because I'm so passionate about it, my schedule is everlasting. It's all day. <laughs> so, you know, when it comes down to it, because I like it, you know, I spend a lot of time doing it so I can just get better. If I didn't like what I was doing, I wouldn't be so uh, push, pushy on myself to just consistently get better and better and better and better. And for individuals who know me, they can see the growth because of that natural inclination to want to learn all the time. So for you guys, make sure that you're very keen on learning and maximizing your resources. That's one of the biggest things that can keep you successful. So I hope that helps you guys. Thank you so much, Mr. Wright. I, I really appreciate that opportunity for being able to speak to students. I think that's going to be something I'm going to be doing for the rest of my life. So thank you so much, man. Peace.